All right, guys. So it's about time. If you go to summons over here, can I go to summons? There we go. Scroll all the way down and go to Masters Pack number one. It says 15 days left. My predictions is after we get a reward for PvP and half a PvP later, we're, we're gonna get Master Pack 2. Well, that's if we get a banner right after Master Pack 1, which is likely, I could see that happening. And the rewards are gonna be like, you know, I don't, I don't think, okay, for the, for the next PvP, I think they're gonna be changed to, uh, you know, Master Pack 2 tickets is my prediction i mean they could probably release it earlier because this leaves in the 22nd and today is the 14th six plus that's like yeah that's eight days from now and no 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 wait no 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 yeah eight days from now 18 hold on 18 to 6 p.m pst oh eight days from now i mean we're not even halfway yet so yeah i guess so like, that makes sense yeah, so it's basically eight days from now, when I'm recording this video, of course, and when it's being uploaded, the um, we're working with distributed. We might get a, ma a new Masters Pack before Master Pack One leaves. Either that, or as soon as it comes, like as soon as after it comes, because they could take out the tickets for the next PvP reward, like next PvP season, and then after the next one, we're gonna get Master Pack Two tickets for free on you know rankings and battle rank 50 so the next pvp match or season we'll get we won't probably have any tickets left so guys if you have tickets golden tickets 30 percent tickets waste them all now guys please you have to waste these tickets before they go because these tickets will expire i mean when this banner leaves you won't be able to use those tickets anymore and all those sparkings you could have pulled or you know all those heroes you probably could have summoned or extremes you could have summoned and getting close to the seven star are chances of that are gone i mean who wants hero unit seven star the only cure unit you want seven star is shallot come on but you can't summon it so there's no point um maybe super saiyan goku is another hero unit you want seven star because he's actually really good like besides shallot he's probably the best hero unit in my opinion but, you know, let, let me know in the comment section below, guys. So, we're going to talk about what's going to be in Master Pack number two. So, the Master Pack number two, uh, one, like, we're, like, well, let me talk about actually how what's in it first. Well, it's all the UST banners, a.k.a. Ultra Space Time, right here, I'll show you. Ultra Space Time. And my predictions is that all these guys... Well, not all these guys. I mean, my prediction is it's going to start from Cell. Reason why Cell? Well, the last uh, UST banner that's on this was the number three. Yeah, UST number three is going to be on here. I mean, it was going to be. Was on here. Oh, oh, my God. I can't speak. Is on here. So, number four is going to be the starter. And it's probably going to end till Super Saiyan Bardock. The reason why I'm not including gohan is because they did this last time with uh, master pack number one super saiyan goku and cell were out you know to summon for on ultra spice ultra spice ultra space tie number four when master pack one came out so i'm guessing when master pack number two comes out feature gohan trunks and feature my won't be included because they're new you can still summon and you have until the next month of the 11th to summon these guys so yeah the master pack is definitely going to leave this month in the end i'm pretty sure like pretty close to the end if not right after master pack number one leaves those are my predictions and if they don't come then like if they don't come like sooner than that then i'm guessing future gohan might be in it but i highly doubt it so let's go talk about it in this over here so i have it loaded up here um we have the, the cell band that's going to be in there and everything that. Let me just talk about what's not going to be in there. This banner, the Legends Rising character banners. Like this Legend Step Ups, like this Hercule, um, Mr. Satan. Uh, what else? Let's scroll up here. Oh, these guys. Fisku, you know, Super, I mean, Super uh, Vegeta has already been in the Master Pack number one. And Super, and Super I mean, just base Bardock 
is not going to be in there because he's a Legends Rising character. Super Saiyan 3 Goku, Base Black, and Majin Vegeta are not going to be in it either because they are Legends Step Up. Go Tanks, you know, Majin Buu, the Boro, they're definitely going to be in there. But we're talking about what's not going to be in there. Broly, obviously, is not going to be in there. Hybrid Legend, hybrid, Legends Hybrids is not going to be in there. Legends Regeneration is not going to be there. Gogeta is not going to be in there. Blue 18 is not going to be there. Pod Frieza is not going to be in there. What else? Obviously, Super Saiyan God, Goku, Beerus, Kauken, and the Tech, uh, the Tech Tech. Green Vegeta are not going to be in there. Just seeing that, guys, right now, and obviously the new Ultra Space Time, and like if it's going to land on my prediction, they're not going to be in there either. So if you're hoping to get Gogeta, hoping to get Blue 18, hoping to get Super Saiyan 3 Goku, Kyle God, anything like that, they're not going to be in there. Trust me, guys. I was hoping some banners would be in there. Like when um, Broly, the Blue Broly came out, I wanted more copies of him. I was hoping he'd... Like, oh, okay, we didn't know my Master Pack, but like when I first heard about the Master Pack being announced in the data mines, I was hoping Broly would be in there. It's like, because it said it's going to be like old units coming back into this banner so you can summon them so i was like oh well it's probably gonna be like broly's gonna be in there well guess what we didn't see them but now let's talk about what's gonna be and i can guarantee you this that's gonna be in the banner and if i'm wrong you can roast me all you want instant transmission goku perfect cell are gonna be in the banner uh let's see Super Saiyan Goats and this right here, Ultra Space Time number 5, all of this can be in there. I don't know if the old units are going to be in there, I can't guarantee you that, but they might. Honestly, that, honestly, they could do that to lower the chance of getting, you know, these broken units, you know, that came out later on the other Ultra Space Time banners. Goating is definitely going to be in there, Majin Buu and Deborah, like I said earlier, they definitely 100% are going to be in there. Let's see, uh, did I skip one? Okay, no, no, no. Uh, where is the next one? Oh, here we go. Bardock, Chill, and Super Saiyan 2 Goku, 1 million percent are going to be in the banner. So, those are all the units that are probably going to be in there. It's not a much, as much as you think. But if you really think about it, my game just turned off. Hold on, guys. Alright, if you really think about it, guys, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 sparking units. Now, if you think about all the other ultra space time characters how many are there 12 characters that are going to be added to the master pack number two and the reason why i say only ultra space time is because all of these characters are either the filler banners or the ultra space time now we haven't had a, a filler banner in a while but if they add them right now it's, it's not going to be included one most likely but the reason why i say filler characters is a like frieza a uh, ginyu who else is a filler character? Super Vegeta and Buff Trunks. Those guys are filler characters. They didn't have an Ultra Space Time name on them. They just had a random name. They were just released randomly. So those are those are what I call filler banners. It's not a Legends Rising character, which is a do equivalent to a Dokkan Fest. And it's not a UST banner, which is just like a normal banner. Like that'll come back. You know, like characters will come back eventually. So, what do you guys think uh, about my predictions and thoughts? Let me know what you guys think was going to be in the banner. Like, I'm hoping that my predictions are right. That US, the USDs that I called out are going to be in there. Are going to be in there. Like, I really, really hope they are. But that's going to be hard for a lot of people. Because more Super Saiyan Bardocks. More... It's a transmission Goku. I honestly can't wait to make my Super Saiyan Goku much, 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 much more stronger. My Goku, my Instant transmission Goku has been sitting at two stars ever since he came out. And I bought that guy. He's like one of the only units that I actually pay to play my box. And the reason why I say pay to play is because if I summon a character at least once with free Chrono Crystals, I count that as a free to play card. I don't count the stars that he has a free to play, but I do count the character in general free to play. But let me know, guys, what you guys think about my predictions. Do you think I'm going to be right? Do you think I'm going to be, like, 50-50? Or do you think I'm going to be completely wrong? But, yeah, guys, leave a like if you guys enjoyed this video. And hope that I'm right or hope that I'm wrong or whatever. I don't know. Leave a dislike if you think I'm going to be wrong. But, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.